My name is Michael McCullough. I work for Amtrak and I'm the low-code business architect. We're a rail company. We provide passenger rail services all across the U.S. At Amtrak, we're actually using all of the power platform to some capacity. Uh, certainly, our, a couple of my favorite ones, it would be the auditing application for Power Apps. So it's an image recognition feature. And so what this does is by rolling this screen over the equipment, it can immediately identify the deficiencies in the product that we're looking at, but it can also start doing things like alerting management, like, hey, this is a serious safety issue. We need to pull this off the line. So that's gonna have a huge impact with the AI functionality in that in the near future. When we look at time savings, uh, we do have five apps that were Project management applications was used for building reports, and we were spending just an inordinate amount of time developing these things. And it was it was all manual process. It just and really, when we started doing these in Power BI, it brought everything to light. So the overall time back to the company was about 1.2 million hours, and overall with a reduction in fines or recoup funding and unneeded software, 68 million. We have roughly 1,500 makers in the company, and these are frontline workers, not programmers. These are financial specialists or HR or interns, and the culture that helped me learn how to do Power Apps and Power BI and Automate, it's been absolutely transformational. It's improved our culture, our collaboration, and it's not just in the everyday individual tasks, but it has had a, a wide and broad effect with the company, which is making us more efficient. Now that they have this support, this tool that they're able to use, they're building things that are just transforming our company. It's making rail travel safer. It's making us more efficient. It's bringing us into the future where we need to be. And what that's gonna do is take away those burdensome tasks. And honestly, I think Microsoft is the company making that happen for us.